I'm going to show you how to add a keyboard shortcut to a macro. Now you can do this when you create the macro, but if you forgot to add it then, you can always do it later. Additionally, any macro whose VBA code you copied from another source, say another workbook or the internet, and you put into this current workbook, even though that VBA code may say it has a keyboard shortcut, so it may say keyboard shortcut is control plus T, the shortcut is not going to be there. So you have to recreate it. You do that by going up to the tools menu, macro, macros, then there you'll see a list of all your macros. I'm going to select protect all, then go to options. Once there, you can enter the shortcut key and a description. So I'm going to make mine control E and enter the description. Then I'm going to go and do it to another one. Make that control Q. Then just close the window and I'm just going to type. So now I'm going to use my shortcut and the sheet is protected. I'm going to unprotect all of them and now I can type again. So that's how you add a shortcut to a macro after it's already in your workbook.